Yo, what up guys? Elaine here from learntobitcoin.co.za and today I'm going to show you guys how I'm currently mining Bitcoin um, but you are able to mine a bunch of other coins um, via this mining application. Uh, so first things first is you can go over to www.minergate.com uh, I will have a link in the description below so you can just check that out. Um, so once we're there, you can see this is the landing page. This is the website. We've got the chat here going on. So people sharing their opinions, their thoughts on the entire app. And you can see the different supported currencies that people are currently mining. So people are mining Zcash, people are mining Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, Bitcoin, Litecoin, Bitcoin, Monero. You know, there's, there's a lot of coins here that you can get a head start on. Um, there's the cheaper coins, there's the more expensive coins, obviously the more expensive the harder to mine it is um, as the as the coin gets mined the harder it, it is to get mined it just works that way with the blockchain and all that kind of stuff so in order to for you to get started mining you can go over to downloads now before you download guys I do recommend checking out the websites you know going through the about section going through the Check out all these different tabs, check out all the, the stats and see what the community is saying. Look it up on Reddit, look it up on the forums, you know, make sure you, you understand what you're getting involved with here. So you go over to downloads and me, myself, I have Windows 64 bits or later. So I download that, boom, I go to my downloads folder, I double click and I install the application. Uh, once you've installed the application, you can check it out here. So here is the application. The, you'll probably land on the wallet, uh, first of all. Um, what you can see here is the different wallets for the different currencies. So if you're mining using Minergate, then you'll store your Minergate earnings in the application here. Uh, you can see the Ethereum wallet, the Dash wallet, the Bitcoin wallet, etc. Uh, here is where you'll be able to withdraw. So I can withdraw this and send it to Poloniex or any one of my other exchanges to exchange for Bitcoin, etc, etc, etc. So what you'll see is on this application they have a smart miner. So the smart miner gives you the most profit, or so it says. Uh, automatically mining the currency that is the highest exchange rate in the last hour. Um, you know, they don't know what's going to happen in future. So at this moment in this last hour, yes, that may be the most valuable currency to mine. But, you know, we never know what's going to happen. So me, myself, I've just set it to mine Bitcoin. The reason being, it is the cheapest, I think one of, the, if not the cheapest, one of the cheapest on this pro program. So I'm able to, to mine a lot of coin quite quickly. Um, and hopefully if this goes up to a dollar in worth then I could you know make a good few <laughs> a good few hundred dollars in a few in a few hours um, it's probably not gonna go up to dollar worth anytime soon but I'm getting a head start personally um, so you can see here that you're able to mine with your CPU and your GPU and you're able to set how many cores so currently I'm using an i7 so I have eight cores uh, I've set it to use six of those to mine currently so then I can make this video uh, I can use my computer and the mining happens in the background um, I'm also able to use my GPU to mine uh, currently I'm actually using Claymore that you can see in my other video to mine Ethereum and Sirecoin using my GPU so I just use this program specifically to for my CPU mining um, and yeah so you can come to any of these and you can click start mining. You set your intensity or the number of cores and it'll just start going. You can see the number of shares that you've discovered here, uh, which ones are bad, which one I've had seven bad shares for 25,000 good ones. The last share was found zero seconds ago. I have a difficulty level here. Uh, as you go, you'll probably see this rise. Um, at the moment, it's not going to probably rise too much in the short term. Um, my unconfirmed balance, so the coins that have been mined but are still being confirmed by the whole system and the blockchain, and then the reward method. So these I am not too concerned about. This is pay per share, pay per something something share. Um, 
you can look more into that or I can make another video going deeper into this. But for now, I'm quite happy to be paid per share. Um, you can hide the coins you're not mining by using these. And that's basically it. So what makes this platform or this mining um, software awesome is that they have gamified it. So if you go to the achievements section, you can see there's different achievements here. There's some of them are grayed out and some of them I have achieved. Um, as you go down, I'm scrolling down here, you can see you get to Claude level. Well, I don't know who Claude is, but that's pretty funny. Um, so if you start mining here, start mining activate or smart mining. You know, if you if you activate the smart mining, boom, you get that. Uh, if you manually activate your mining, you get that. So the rewards are quite easy in the beginning. If you do your benchmark, which um, kind of tests your hardware to see what level you're on, then you get that. Um, I recommend just going and getting as many as you can. And once you start mining, you'll see uh, these rewards start to show. One hour of mining, 24 hours of mining, 100 shares sent, 1,000 shares, 10,000, mining for four hours. And as it goes, the more rewards you get, apparently you get a nice big, yeah, each step brings you closer to his defeat. Oh, you gotta defeat Claude or something, I don't know. Um, once you complete all the challenge, you can win their prize, which I'm not too sure what the prize is. I think it's gonna take me a fair, quite a while to achieve all of these things. Um, quite a cool thing here, access the log file, boom. And that's easy, you just click there and you click whatever one you want and you can access that file you get that little perk and the auto miner is you know I think the program automatically when you start your computer up it starts up and you get that once you restart your computer for the first time when you trade or you withdraw your coins then you get these ones as well so for the different sections and the different things you can do with the coins you get different achievements so log in download set your benchmark um, have a look at your achievements. You can look at the other pools. Um, oh, with this here, you can, if you want to manually add a pool, you can do that. That's advanced and not needed for now. Um, Smart Miner, you can go ahead and activate that if you just don't even want to think. You let the program think for you. Um, and here you can see, if I want to withdraw this, I just say how many of them. It gives me my mining fee there and I can put the address, my Poloniex receive address for Bitcoin over there and withdraw, really easy guys. This is a nice, easy, simple way to mine free coins, whether it's Monero, whether it's Dash, whether it's Ethereum Classic or Ethereum Normal. You know, my computer's working for me while I'm at work and I'm making some free coin on the side. Um, the awesome thing about Minergate as well is if you install this on your Android phone, if you install it on another computer, if you've got more than one computer, you can use those computers to mine via the same accounts. So you can speed up your mining by using various different machines all logged into the same accounts and then you can mine at hyperspeed. If you somehow manage to acquire 20 computers, you can use 20 of your processors to mine whatever coin you like. So guys, that's basically it. I mean, CPU and GPU mining, various coins, quick and easy to install. You got games, you got a nice GUI interface here. Um, and yeah, that's basically it guys. This is super easy, super quick, and it's just a way to get some more coins on your hands. I know we're all trying to diversify our portfolios and things here. So free coins, obviously your electricity is going to go up um, with the increased power usage on your CPU and your graphics card if you do that. So be aware um, of those financial uh, increases or your, your electricity increases. Um, and know that if you choose to, the, to do this, guys, this is of your own accord. You know, the software um isn't is developed by this company if you have any issues with it please email them um, i'm not too well versed in the troubleshooting of the program um, so if you choose to use this program guys please just read up know what you're getting into uh with the costs and all the all the details so that's it guys thank you so much for watching um, if you checked out this video and it helped you get your head around mining and what it takes and how you can, 
uh, please like please comment please subscribe please let us know which coins you think are worth mining and uh, your hash rates you know do you have an i3 do you have an i7 what kind of graphics card do you have uh, what kind of hash speeds are you getting um, all of these I find super interesting um, also if you have ways to increase your hash speeds you know do you know any 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 secret crypto ways to increase comment them below um, the the community will will greatly appreciate any tips or tricks you might have but thanks again guys for watching like comment and subscribe we'll be uploading more videos very soon um, and yeah have a great day further cheers